Hello everyone, welcome to the Cloud Network. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to install your PHP Virtual Box in Ubuntu 15.04. You can also install this virtual PHP Virtual Box in uh, like uh, Ubuntu 14.04, Ubuntu 14.010 X, Ubuntu L Ubuntu Debian also. The same method, the same procedure you need to follow that I am going to show you. And every step, every command you can find in the descri description box below to my video. So let us first of all what is your requirement so this is my I'm going to first of all download and then I'm going to install it then I'm going to configure this PHP virtual box and also virtual box so, so, so these two methods I'm going to configure installation downloading and uh, I'm using Ubuntu 14.04.02 and uh, you can also do in other distribution also so what is your virtualization is nothing but virtualization is nothing but uh, process of creating non virtualization systems and also operating like storage network is give and also is give your uh, network resources and hardware virtualization achieved by creating virtual machine which is provided by operating systems and is also can host and can monitor your servers uh, so it provide different operating system like windows linux unix bsd what is your virtual box nothing but virtual box is nothing but is it is a uh, release under the license in 2007 under the Oracle Corporation started. So it's written in the completely C and C C plus assembled in different available language like so we having uh, uh, OS like Windows, OS Mac, o, Mac OS X, Linux, Solaris. So VirtualBox claims to be original uh, only professionally virtualized solutions and freely available. It's open source and it's available for 64-bit guest OS as well as creative snapshot for the virtual OS also. So it supports your virtualization application along with real desktop applications. More it can uh, configure to hold the 64-bit uh, as well as 32-bit uh, platform support. So now I'm going to start the installations. My first of all I'm going to uh, download the virtual box and the PHP virtual box in my Ubuntu. So first of all, I'm going to update my uh, uh, packages and I'm going to install that some dependencies are there like Apache PHP. So for this first step, one is the command to update your uh, Ubuntu. And after that, this is uh, step two to install the Apache. Then step three is to install the PHP and uh, this uh, dependency. And the fourth one is to install the uh, essential buildings so this is your DKMS and the fifth one is we need to open the source list in that we need to uh, put this uh, line dep.thdpv semicolon download virtual box after that uh, we need to add the oracle public key so this is a command to add the oracle public key so after that uh, we need to download first of all bed get is nothing but downloading then adding the oracle public key is the step uh, 6 and 7 to download and add the oracle public so let us uh, begin with step to 7 and 6 so my friend uh, you need to use su to login with the root uh, and uh, after that login with the root is very good or else you can use any other also so after login with the root and uh, just type cd okay, clear this one now start with typing apt hyphen get and update and plus type two time update then type apt hyphen get upgrade here need to type here and use and two times again then type apt hyphen get auto remove so this will remove your any unknown packages this will get your remove space it will give auto removes update and upgrade so you need to after typing you need to press enter here which i have already done this one update so i am do, so I am skipping this step. So now I move to the next step. That one is uh, uh, installing the packages like apt hyphen get install uh, Apache to press enter. So you press Y to continue. So this has been done. Restart web server Apache to is okay. Now I am going to clear this one. We'll move to the next step and just type a key and remove your apache in place of apache you need to type php give five give a space then php five and then give hyphen com and common and then give php again and give hyphen s 
O A P so P H P phi and need to give hyphen J D. So after typing this command, you need to press enter here. So now press yes to continue this one. So now this one has been up uh, installed, downloaded. Now I'm going to press a key and removing this dependency and just type here uh, build. Okay, use hyphen uh, essential into type here. Okay, and then you need to give a space D K M and use S unzip wet get. So this is a command to install the building essential. So you need to just press enter here. It's going to be download 32 MB operation of this. Now that's also dependency uh, also install. Now I'm clearing. Now we need to open the we need to uh, open the packages. Like I'm going to uh, have uh, edit type vi instead of vi you can use nano ged also type slash etc slash apt. Okay, so give a slash here. So vi ged also the same method type. Uh, slash etc slash apt to edit the source file so just press and enter okay here i am going to add the line which i have shown you now just scroll down and uh, scroll down to have last one line so here go to the last line and type here uh, I think I will do one thing here. I will copy this whole line, okay, and I will paste here. What I will do is just uh, from here, we'll do remove this one, okay, and type here, okay, HTTP here. Uh, I'm going to remove completely, okay, download, type download dot virtual box dot org slash vi virtual and to give here virtual box slash dpn okay give ray ring it's a sort of rating you can give quantel precious uh, lucid vz gc quizy the flavor of this uh, name you need to give here so just give a space and type here contribute so add this line and after that uh, instead of this rearing you can use your quantal precious uh, lucid vz uh, just you can use any name here so after that you need to just save this file and uh, close this one okay and now you need to clear this one and now move to the next step that uh, I'm going to uh, download and Oracle adding the Oracle public key uh, with that one. So first of all, I'm going to download the wetgear www dot. That means I'm downloading the virtual box here and dot org uh, slash download slash Oracle use underscore v box and dot asc a uh, press enter it's not connecting so this has been downloaded it's actually so we'll move to the, this has been save okay it's 1.7 kb is the file and type apt hyphen key and add oracle and press a tab to get a full command press enter here so that has been okay you can see now we'll move to the so we'll move to the next step the step four fifth is a restarting the apache service so this is a 10 step and level are the same the same command is there you can type either 10 or a level also anyone you can type for this year in ubuntu and uh, fifth one is to we need to point your browser and type with the ip address to look back uh, or else you can you have a look look back ip address to check our working or not so let us start now so just clear this one 
and type systematic CTL give space restart Apache Apache 2 dot SCVR service sorry service you need to type here press enter uh, if it is not work means we have another command that when slash etc slash n dot d then you slash apache apache 2 and restart it so you can see on the screen okay this has been restarted now we'll move to your uh, first of all we check the ip address by typing if config so my ip address is 192.168.0.2 now I am opening the my browser and there I am going to type the IP address. So here I am going to type in my IP address. Uh, so 192.168.0.114. That's my IP address. So after typing the IP address, you can see on the screen so these are the two came we came. Uh, my system file system is there. I am clicking on the HTML and uh, this is a private uh, so you can use have a so you can see apache ubuntu default page is working here so we'll move to the next step here you can use loopback ip address also instead of my ip address this is my default web page of Ap 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 apache is working now we'll move to the next step here now you can see on step six seven eight nine are the uh, procedure for that I'm going to first of all is step 6 is now the time to install the virtual box so this one command to install then I'm going to download and install the PHP virtual box then step 14 the 15 to install and unzip then step 8 is to uh, move this uh, download uh, into that um, move this excited folder into the PHP uh, folder and default we need to move the excited folder php virtual box will come up with the version 4.3.3 is the version latest version and that's going to move in the default route so after that i'm going to rename the php virtual box 4.3.3 uh, to php vb or anything you can give a name so step 17 is a command to have procedure so let us begin now now it's time to install the virtual box typing apt hyphen get install virtual box use hyphen that's a 4.3 and use your hyphen 3 again so to have a latest one just hit and enter let me see what it's going to show I cannot find the package use hyphen 3 So my friend, there is an alternate method also is there to install virtual box. Just open Ubuntu Software Center. From there, you can install the virtual box. Click to install now. So my friend, that has been downloaded and installed. We'll check whether it's uh, downloaded or not. Type, click on the search bar. You need to type here virtual. So wait, it's browsing coming. So we got here virtual box icon here is there and see here is your virtual box and clicking on that one we come up so here is my virtual box which I will install I'm going to minimize this one now we'll move to the next step uh, that is installing PHP virtual box so clear this one now we'll move to the next step uh, step type wet get and use your HTTP semicolon slash slash and type source uh, f for uh, dot net and use your slash again project projects you go for a slash php virtual virtual box use slash then type files use slash php virtual box and hyphen give the version for this latest one if you want to go for the previously version is just replace this version with your current version so you can go for the 3.1 4.2.1 uh, also just replace 4.3 hyphen 3 go for the zip 
dot zip and so just press here enter here uh, it's connecting and now it's showing okay so this is a download it's just 4.1 mb is it which i have been downloaded so now we're going to unzip this one uh, type unzip and use your php uh, press a tab to get a full command press enter uh, this also has the unzip here clear type ls to check so this one is the three folders we came this one is your unzip folder which we uh, name is there now we'll move to the extracted folder php workshop box hyphen 4.3 uh, to uh, root folder so just type mv move and type your php yeah this one and give us uh, hyphen version 4. Point, oh, it's already came right so just give a space here slash where uh, slash ww slash also there is a you can move you can press enter here also or you can type html also so anything you can move here anything you want to move where uh, like ww you want to move there you can move from the html folder you can move you can move here just press enter here so that's moved and i'm going to rename the file type mb for the rename slash where okay slash ww okay then type html okay then give php uh, sorry here we i am giving a new name like php uh, vb so instead of php vb 